had a bird one time on my balcony that I found on the ground that had a broken leg. Right. And it was a little, the mom kept coming down and checking on it. So I put a little cap from an Evian bottle and I filled it with water and I put it near the baby bird. And then the mother came and she drank out of the cap. She like figured out what I was doing. And then she fed it to the little uh, baby that couldn't get up. And he, he would try to get up on the one leg, but the other leg stuck straight out. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So I go down every morning, every morning. I end up meeting one of my old, the, the elderly gentlemen that lived on the first floor of the apartment building. And we'd go out every day together and check on this little bird. And so I would always say, here I am, broken leg. I'm bringing you something to eat, you know. And I would put little breadcrumbs down and everything else. So about two months into this little bird getting all the feathers and getting a little stronger and still trying to get up on that one leg, Every morning before I would go downstairs for these few weeks that went by, weeks and weeks, I would always say, I'm coming down, broken leg, I'll be right down. I'm just like a, I don't know. You know, I lived alone. <laughs> so, I, one day I go, I'm coming down, broken leg, and I hear, and here comes his mom, and here comes broken leg with his leg sticking straight out, up to my balcony. Yeah. He flew up to see me, and you guys, you know what? I stayed in that apartment for four years because broken leg was on the balcony every morning. <laughs> for two years, I'm like, I can't leave broken life.